I am not a furry, but the thing I like about the Blight's new cat skin in Dead by Daylight is it's possibly not even the Blight that you're playing as when you have this skin equipped. For the Cursed Cat cosmetic collection in Dead by Daylight, most of the skins are the entity transforming the character based on a core memory they had involving cats. For instance, the Wraith had a stray cat that he used to feed at the Auto Haven Wreckers until one day it got a little curious and went exploring and we all know what curiosity does to cats. The Hillbillies is based on a cartoon cat that he considered to be his only friend growing up, which a little depressing, but okay. The Clowns is based on a cat missing poster that he saw, and then he decided to write his own fan fiction on the poster about all the terrible things that he was hoping happened to it. The Plagues is about a hairless cat that knocked over her incense, and The Tricksters is about a vicious cat fight that he uploaded to his social media until his PR team made him take it down. But the Blight's Dead by Daylight cat skin, however, it comes at a higher price point, it has its own unique model, and it has cat noises intermingled with the Blight's usual Blight noises. This suggests that the skin is instead a fundamental change in the Dead by Daylight character itself, kind of like the Minotaur or the Baba Yaga skins, and the lore suggests this as well. The Blight was experimenting on some mice with his various serums and substances when he noticed that the mice were missing. He saw a cat scurrying away with several mice in its mouth and tried to chase it down. In the end, all he ended up finding was a corpse of an unknown animal that had been torn apart from the inside. Now, it's possible that the unidentified corpse was just the cat who died, and that this cosmetic, like the other Dead by Daylight cat skins, is simply the entity taking this memory of the Blights and merging him with the cat who ate a cocktail full of experiments. However, due to the ultra rare cosmetics often being used to designate an entirely new character, it's possible that the feline's mutation caused it to have a transformation similar to that of a gnoll from Dungeons and Dragons, which tear out of a hyena's stomach after they've been fed a humanoid and cursed by dark magic. Instead of using magic, this cat may have eaten a bunch of infected mice, some other animals, and then was split the F open by the cocktail of blight serums, thus birthing a blighted cat monster that the entity decided to take into the realm of Dead by Daylight as well. Ultimately, it's left open to interpretation, but the fact that the torso is called Feline Mutation and features a group of rat skulls and cat skulls all fused together, I feel like you're playing as the cat and not as some nightmare version of the Blight fused with it. But let me know what you think.